Today we're going to be talking about festive wear because if you're anything like me and you go online and you see those fancy looks and all that you think is, oh no, I have nothing like that in my closet, don't worry, I'm in the same boat. <laughs> so I have a few tips that I personally use to spice up my basic pieces and make them a little bit more festive. So the first tip that I have is instead of buying your play normal tights, go for something fun and sparkly because if it's cold, we need to wear tights anyway, so why not go for something fun? I personally have two options right here right now. So the first one are new tights with gold thread. So they sparkle a little bit. They're not super dramatic, but if you go up close, you can really see the difference and they're just a little bit more unique and a little bit more fun. I especially love wearing this with higher boots because then you can only just see a little bit of the skin, a little bit of a sparkliness, and I really enjoy that look. But then I have black tights that have polka dots and also silver little dots. Again, they're not super dramatic. You have more dramatic options out there as well which are great but this is what I personally love especially with all black outfits and then if I have my black pumps on and just a black dress it just looks super stylish super fun super sparkly and I really enjoy that look now the second tip that I love using is to use higher boots, over the knee boots, knee boots, anything like that with my more delicate items because I feel if you go really delicate on top you have a delicate dress and then a delicate heels and delicate back very quickly it doesn't look as festive because I think the boots give the dress or the outfit that kind of festive vibe it seems like okay it's a bit colder it's a bit wintry and i really love that tip plus when i'm wearing this kind of boots when it's for festive wear i usually show a little bit more skin so if i have shorts on i show a little bit more skin than usually because in the winter i usually have black tights but for festive wear I allow myself to kind of be more revealing. <laughs> but you don't have to stop at the boots, you can also do it the other way around. So instead of having wintery shoes, you can have something wintery on top, such as a cashmere dress, knitwear dress, and then you combine it with more delicate shoes, such as pumps. I really enjoy that look, it's so festive, it's so easy to put together. Now the third tip that I use is that I go really bold on outfits. My mantra that I use for Christmas and New Year's is more is more, okay? <laughs> Usually my outfits are really minimal, but not when it comes to festive wear because I allow myself to go really over the top. I combine different materials, lace, fur, leather, suede, all of that stuff. I go really bold in the eyes, the hairstyle, the nails, all of that. I go really bold and for me, like I said, more is absolutely more. So don't be afraid to play around with your closet and you know, just go over the top. You, you can have a lot of fun that way and you can create some amazing stylish festive outfits. Now the fourth tip that I love using is to add as much sparkle as I possibly can but because I don't have sequin pieces in my wardrobe I have to be a bit more creative so I personally love using silk because I can still wear it throughout the year even when the holidays are over but at the same time they can be very festive in the holiday season because they are reflective and especially if you have them in those kind of lighter colors or maybe red or maybe green something like that they're gonna look very festive and fun but obviously I also add as much sparkly jewelry as I can, uh, everything that has crystal, that sparkles, all of that stuff. Plus, like I said before, I use tights for that as well. Then the fifth tip that I have is that I add red to my outfit, which is really Christmassy and New Year's Eve. <laughs> so I personally love a red nail polish. It just so amazing and so elegant and stylish. Then also today what I'm wearing, a lipstick, I combine two lipsticks to get this look because I don't have the proper red. Um, but then I also love wearing red pieces in my wardrobe. But again, if you don't have anything like that, don't worry, you know, a lipstick here, nail polish there, maybe a hair accessories that you can wear in your hair, something like that. Small things like this can make a huge, huge difference. And then the sixth tip that I love using is to go monochrome. Yeah, I can have some red in my nails or on my lips, but when it comes to the outfit, I really love monochrome looks because they're super easy to pull off. They're really stylish, they're really elegant, and you know, I just cannot go wrong when wearing something monochrome. So I personally have a lighter option, which not all colors match, but that's absolutely fine. As long as they're kind of similar and lighter for me, I just feel this is a really amazing lighter monochrome look. And then I also have the darker option with all black pieces, but I make sure that the textures and materials are a bit different. So, you know, you can see them, you can see the difference in the materials and all of that. 
And then the seventh tip that I have is that I try to implement as many tips that I showed you just now into one outfit because it's not just one tip, one outfit. I can have five tips in one outfit and it's going to be much more festive. So this is my challenge to myself. Like I said, more is more. This is my mantra for Christmas and New Year's Eve. So hopefully this inspires you to kind of go through your closet and spice it up a little bit and you don't have to buy anything new. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. It means a lot to me and I will see you next time.